this? Yeah, people get saved out here through Mardi Gras through this preaching every single year. Because what happens is they come out to Mardi Gras and every single sin imaginable is available to them on Bourbon Street. All they have to do is just ask for it or pay for it and they can have any sin they want. And we have people that have, can have any sin that they want and it still doesn't satisfy. Then they walk around the corner and see banners with gospel messages on it and they realize this is what satisfies. Uh, and this is all... What? Well, the Bible says in Proverbs 17, 11, that an evil man seeketh only rebellion, therefore a cruel messenger shall be sent against him. Uh, God told the prophet Ezekiel that when I say unto the wicked that thou shalt surely die, and you, Ezekiel, give us them not warning, nor speak to warn the wicked from his way to save his life, then that wicked man shall surely die for his sins, but his blood I'll require at your hands. God told Ezekiel that he didn't warn the wicked, whether they listened or refused, that their blood would be upon his hands. Your blood's not on our hands. We've warned you. We've given you fair warning. That shirt. Uh, it mo moves like him. Your sister is visiting from out of town. Let's get something straight. God doesn't need forever. Sorry for us forever. It's because you're 17 trillion dollars in debt. God gives in the world. You said that's what I said. You're part of us. Hey, hey, hey. That is communist. And that butcher's baby is a girl's Christian. That's right. That communist China. The only reason you have any Thank you. 
and sit down and read it with a sober mind, wipe the smile off your face and get serious about the living God. That's good sound advice if you know how to take good sound advice.